Hello guys, my name is Keisha and welcome to my channel. This is my top 10 lists of things that you should do before a concert. If you didn't know, there is an amazing band coming to South Africa, Thy Art is Murder. They are one of my favorites. Their music is fucking amazing. I'm going to try and see if I can help you prepare for this weekend's concert. My video today is going to be specifically about Thy Art Is Murder because they are coming here on the 4th of November and I am so fucking excited to see what they're going to do for us because have you seen a live show? <laughs> Fangirling so fucking hard for this shit, you don't even understand. It's so bad. Number one is secure your position. I went to a checkers and I had a 600 bucks. I secured my position with Witch Doctor and Compute Ticket. Number two, save money for merch and any intoxicants you might want. Me personally, I would rather save the money for merch because. Their stuff is amazing. Have you seen those windbreak? Holy shit. I have to get a fucking cap. This is my collection that I'm proud of. Riddle break. This is one of the first ones that I bought. It's still really fucking awesome quality, but they've stepped up their game so much. This is my favorite cap. The fact that there's artwork over here. Oh my fuck. I wear this thing everywhere. We're lucky South Africans, guys. Love them. They're playing on Friday, the 3rd of November. The band in my next video, Red Helen! So, that's the part of my collection that I'm proud of, and Thy Art is Mona is going to be added to that. Number three, repeat the necessary songs. Okay, so um, I've had a look on the internet, obviously, that shit's available. Six songs from Holy War and six songs from Dead Desolation. It is the best gift to fans that could have ever been given. Number four is read lyrics. My favorite place to get lyrics is dark lyrics on the internet just because I uh, trust dark lyrics you can but try other places my preferred site for metal lyrics number five is my favorite one okay so I love watching live shows uh, mainly just because I enjoy seeing the audience and what the artists do okay, with number the six audience. very important especially in South Africa because you never know what's gonna happen just generally in life. You never know when you're gonna get a gift from the universe, so prepare yourself. Get to know the band, and um, it might help you with tip number seven. Uh, tip number seven, think of your once in a lifetime question, because you never know what's gonna happen. The possibility of meeting any of these people would blow my fucking mind. Going in unprepared would be the dumbest thing possible. So, you never know what's gonna happen. Maybe he's in the middle of a crowd surf and he has time to answer your question. Number eight. This is something I figured out after years of going to rumors and <laughs> having these local band CDs and wanting them to sign it but then I don't have something for them to write with. So I always carry a permanent marker in my bag. Number nine, get psyched with friends. Okay, I tell all my friends about this. And my friends who enjoy thy art, we jam thy art together and spread the word because South Africa is not good at transferring information when it comes to metal and this is a fucking amazing band and they're from Australia, they're an international band. I don't want them to cancel just because of s sales, like that's my main fear. Number 10 is the one I had most fun with and it's make fan shirts and posters because you need to be noticed by a band member or the band because you never know what happens maybe they wanna blaze with you maybe they wanna do something <laughs> I live in a bit of a fantasy world thank you so much for watching I hope you guys have your money jars ready and I will see you on Saturday bye